Hello YouTube, this is Moot, and this is our Worm Online, Worm Unlimited tutorial. In this episode, we're going to learn about prospecting to find ore, making a mine tunnel, and then mining in order to uh, find ore to mine so that we can continue on building our house. Let's begin. First off, let's go ahead and drag our pickaxe down into our tool belt for easier access. Next. We want to prospect different rock tiles in order to find out if we can find any ore nearby. Prospecting just tells you uh, in four tile radius if there's ore nearby. So I will highlight our pickaxe. I will click the rock tile and then I will also prospect. And we begin prospecting. And we find that there is ore nearby. Now, this is ore within four tiles, four tiles all directions, four tiles east, west, north, and south. Um, there's a great guide on prospecting in the Wormpedia. To access in game, you can click on your menu, wiki search, and you can type in prospecting. And it'll actually give you a nice guide on how to prospect and we're looking for the main thing you want to do is um, you want to just kind of find out where in the area your ore is and then you can go ahead and create a tunnel so I have already had and I've gone ahead and prospected and I know that this is where I want to build my tunnel so let's go ahead and start a tunnel so I'm gonna click the rock I'm gonna make sure my pickaxe is activated and then I'm going to head and create a tunnel. Now it takes approximately 50 actions to create a tunnel along with um, mining a specific tile inside the, um, the actual cave itself. And you can see here when it's about five, I think five actions away, it will tell you that you will soon create an entrance. Uh -huh. Fill the stamina. Try it again. Now, worm is kind of boring because it's a lot of just kind of watching the uh, ticker and the, uh, the ticker countdown. But it's one of the beauties of this game. It's pretty relaxing. And you can kind of just click and relax and be casual. Okay, so I created my cave and you can tell if I look back there's my cave and sometimes as I was, I was creating or tunneling it dropped some rock shards so out of 50 actions it dropped eight rock shards and you can use that to make bricks or what we'll use is make bricks and forges and the like so if I enter the cave there's cave walls there's cave ceilings and cave floors um, and you can manipulate these if you go ahead and highlight your pickaxe and then you click the cave wall in front of you, it gives you the option to mine forward, to mine down, to mine up, and to prospect. Now prospecting inside the cave is um, its really useless. It doesn't really do a whole lot. We can go ahead and do it. If you want to increase your prospecting, you can only prospect one tile three times uh, within a logon period. But it's a good way to increase your skills. Higher prospecting tells you the type of quality of iron. Um, when you get to a certain amount, you can prospect an iron or even a rock tile or cave tile. And it will tell you what type of quality, utmost, good, uh, above average, low quality, etc. And you can tell my mining has increased as well. So the more I mine, the more it increases. So this pretty much is the entire tutorial on how to uh, create a mine. So there's not really much. I'm going to go ahead and pause the video and just keep mining until I find ore. And then I'll show you in the next episode how not only to mine ore, but also to take raw ore to make them into lumps so you can craft more tools. Thanks for watching.